Hey guys, welcome back to the Hunter Call of the Wild. We're here on Medved, the most popular map to do the Moose Great One grind. And we're going to go over a few things you might not know about Moose Drink Zones here on Medved. First, we're going to talk about Shrinking Drink Zones. Now, this happened to me three times when I first started grinding Moose on Medved. I was going zone to zone doing herd management, and every now and then I would come across a herd that was five Moose. Now, I always go up and identify the drink zone indicator before I start shooting a zone just to make sure it's not a herd of four and possibly a solo because I don't want to start shooting a solo if I don't have to. Now, when I was walking up though, I did notice that I think I saw an extra moose. So we're going to look around. See, the drink zone indicator here does say it's a herd of five. So that's a good thing. But I swear I saw an, an extra moose, so I'm going to look around here and check some drink zone indicators. See, that one's another herd of five. This one's all the way over here. Let's check this. Oh, that's a herd of one. See, so that's a solo. So this is a herd of five and a solo right next to it. So here, you have to be careful to figure out which one is a solo. So the easiest way to do that is you first stay on that solo drink zone indicator and it will be attached to some footprints so then you just find the footprints and it'll tell you if it's a male or female and so it's a female solo zone so then everything in the herd of five both of the males are good to go but now in my experience when I've shot at a herd of five it has ejected one of those males turned it into a solo and shrunk that zone down to a herd of four so we're going to see if that happens again here so here we are with that herd of five and the solo female and we are going to kill one of the males in the herd of five and see if it gets ejected out and see if the zone shrinks now we've already verified with the drink zone indicator that it's a herd of five after we kill this male when we spend time and come back we will check the drink zone indicator again and see if it is still a herd of five Now we're going to advance time to the next day and force the respawn and see if it actually respawns or if the zone shrinks down to a 4. So now it's the next day we force the respawn out and we're going to check the herd to see if the male actually respawned. I see 5 moose but one of them must be that female solo because I only see one male which means the male I shot did get ejected out and that zone shrunk down. Now we're going to go up and check the drink zone indicator to verify this of course because we can't just go off of what we see but the drink zone indicator might say four. Okay here we are at their drink zone and we're going to take a look at their drink zone indicator to see if there's still a herd of five or just a herd of four now. Is that it? There it is. Let's see look at that it's a herd of four we saw before it said it was a herd of five and now it's a herd of four so it has ejected that male out and become a solo and shrunk the zone so there you go one thing about medved you might not have known the second thing that you might not know about moose drink zones in medved is that some of them are not accessible now if you go to the far upper right hand corner of my map out here on the ice I have a lot of drink zones and all the way at the end here there is one drink zone right here and that is that guy right there now I've never shot him because I can't get to this drink zone I found this out the first time I saw it because we all know that I like to go out and look at a drink zone indicator to make sure that it's a solo or not attached to a herd or whatever. And I tried to go out to look at this drink zone indicator and I couldn't get there. It respawned me back into the map because I was outside the reserve. So here we are, we're approaching that drink zone where that moose just was. He's no longer there because I've spooked him out. I'm going to try to get close enough to see the drink zone indicator. Oh, but look at that. It says leaving reserve, turn back. Even if I try to get out there, it's going to respawn me. I might be able to get there to see it. That's just his footprints. 
This is the furthest out here I've ever been. Oh, but it respawned me in. And I'm back at the outpost where it respawned me. Now I wasn't able to reach the drink zone indicator, which tells me I shouldn't shoot that moose because I probably can't harvest it. So I basically have an inaccessible drink zone that I cannot use. Now this won't be the case for everybody, but you'll want to check the upper right hand corner of your medved map just to see if you have a drink zone outside the game reserve. Let me know in the comments below if you too found a drink zone that you can't use. The third thing you might not know about moose drink zones in Medved is that not all of them are located on obvious bodies of water. There are in fact four hidden lakes in Medved that can all contain drink zones. This herd in front of me is actually right here in the middle of the snow. If you zoom all the way in you can see a flat little depression of what used to be a lake and there is in fact a drink zone there. And there are four of these here on Medved. The four hidden lakes are located here, 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 and right here. That should help you find all of your moose drink zones in Medved. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.